hey what's up guys welcome back to my channel hope you guys is doing absolutely great today i want to share with you how to make this e flyer design before jumping into this let's check the intro Take up graphic skills with creativity. Please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and click the bell to be notified when we post new videos. So without wasting much of our time guys, let's dive into today's tutorial. Yeah, good day guys. Welcome back to Deco Graphic Design Training. Hope you guys are doing absolutely great. Today, I want to show us how we can make a Ramadan promo flyer on our Android smartphone using our PC lab. In this tutorial, there is much to learn as usual. I want you to stick around and take your time to watch and learn the new skills so that at least you can add out the new skills to your skills. And this will actually help you in a long way whenever you want to make any of design related to this. Without wasting much of our time, let's dive into this. I don't want to sound, I do, it's not necessary for me to select the background size anymore because I have an external background I want to use. Now click on these three dots and import the image from the gallery. Then you have this. After getting this, then the next thing that you are going to do, I will just employ you to. I will employ you to get all the uh, uh, all the element you want to use. Get it imported to the gallery. I have two of these uh, chicken. You can actually you choose any one because because excuse everything will be dropped for the prices. So I decided to go for this. Then I position it here and I have it locked. I will go back to my gallery because everything is already set. And everything is already working even before the design was concluded to be made. Now, after I employ this, I'm going there to import this as well. And at the end of the day, you will see the reason how these elements are useful. Make design, de delay this, and import all the elements. Import this, send it to the back, as you can see. Then have it lock immediately. Go back to your gallery, then you import the next one. Just kill it out exactly like this and send it to the back, and you have it locked immediately. All this a brush and other resources you see me using here, you can actually get them everything on www.pngheg.com. www.pngegg.com that is where i source for all the images you see here you can actually check them out and all these are uh, uh, what i selected and i sent the back they are called splash brush once you type a splash brush you will even see some that are far better than this it goes it is very good for you to make a research I mean, on how to get the element or you get the pack of these elements at the finger of your tips. Then, to you see, this is another one you can use any one that you want. But I'm thinking of not using this. But let me see. If I send this to the back, this will actually come here. So which one is okay between the two? I will use the first and I will use the second one at the same time. I mean, later in this particular design. So now that everything has been set, then the next thing I'm going to do is to go with all my write-ups to make everything okay. I think it will remain one, which I'm going to import it here. And that will be, let's check this. No, it's not this. Yeah. So uh, we have to import the call icon. Then we have a make contact icon. Now everything is actually plumb. So the next thing I'm going to do is to name the what or the brand name that is uh, that is on point chicken on point 
restaurant on point restaurant so we we'll put this here then we go to we we, we we position it here now we are going to we are going to our font then we use uh we use cabin boat font for this particular area so i'm going here to select the shape and the position it well so after dropping the shape into this particular area so i'm going to tap on these images tap on these images then i will have a position here i will now copy the image and put uh, on point i'll put on point chicken so just i have restaurants on point restaurant so now we have this being reduced and positioned under this but we'll make sure that everything is actually aligned are you getting it those are the things that you need to know as a graphic designer learn how to make things your design or element being aligned i have everything being locked so at the button here we are going to type ramadan remember i saw this is a ramadan promo so we'll have ramadan as you can see so now i want to use a, a kind of a font that will actually show this area so let's select uh, wc manonigra boot wc manonigra boot i will actually uh, drop the link to the font here uh, for the practice and you can actually uh, get them on the google as well i just was uh, searching around ransacking the online and i came across the font and i see that uh, it will be very okay for this particular design so now increase and uh, have a position here you make sure that everything is actually aligned exactly as i said so after that we go to our shape i mean test area then we type promo so we're supposed to copy but we made that mistake we need to correct it so that is the long process so we increase this a little bit and position it here mm -hmm. you go to alignment and make sure that uh, the promo is actually aligned as well <clears throat> now on getting here so right now the next thing that we are going to do we need to change the color to the promo we use our color picker to pick a color from the background then we have it being positioned we are going to treat all those uh, all these uh, text right up later now the next thing we are going to do go to your test area then you put some of uh, a kind of an advert then must try let's put it there and see must try then we need to use the uh, use a a font that is not really let's use a bobby one bobby one font so we have it like this then we rotate and position so you cough it let it cough but let it be aligned with this that's why you have to move it closer to this area then you have it being rotate you rotate it as you can see you see what i did here you rotate and go to cough again and have it cough a little bit have it cough a bit so now everything is actually plumb from this area so the next thing to do we can add a stroke so let the stroke be um let the stroke be tap from this uh, the color to the stroke be tap from this uh, background as well as i did now so the next thing we are going to do is to just make everything perfect make it perfect yeah you make it perfect so let's look at the uh, how what we can write here again so we'll go to our text area so we put the name of uh, let's send this to the back this splash brush let, i mean send it to the front okay send this to the back the second one should be sent to okay this one should be sent to the front back let's check the second one to the front okay good 
then we will have this one to be sent to the front okay so now we are now put chicken glam chicken let's say chicken glam so we will have to use a better phone for this if only use a banger font then we increase the size and we have it this is this is very very good for all this uh, restaurant flyer design when you see this font i actually use it a lot in all my chicken and restaurant design even for majority i like you see for my client as well so now we have a chicken glam for here so the next thing that we are going to do we copy the same thing and we'll put the price so the dollar we have a dollar so and that is a 13 dollar so let's see 13 dollar then we'll put the dot here so let it close a bit let it close exactly like this and we'll position this here we'll position it here so the next thing we are going to do after position here we are going to copy and uh, cancel we are going to copy and we put uh, 99 you see what i did then we are going to increase the size and put it it will be on top of this so we reduce and put it on top of this but you make sure that everything is actually aligned properly so after that we are going to copy this bobby font and we have order now order now so we tap the color and remove the stroke we tap from this color and if we didn't tap from this color we can tap from something like this you can see so after tapping on it there is a lot to treat it there is a lot to treat here and uh, we are going to remove the stroke after that we go to the stroke remove the stroke then we return the rotation so after doing that the next thing that we are going to do right now is to position this here let it be here order now now we are going to copy from the promo and we have whatsapp uh, let's put whatsapp number so let's say whatsapp you can see then we are going to put semicolon like this uh, and put our phone number let's say three four five three four five six seven just a design anyway then we are going to reduce it to be in line with this are you getting it so we can add the real number to this let's use 70 34 34 so after that we are going to change the color to black we change the color click on plus sign and you move it to make it darker then we are going to reduce the size to make sure that uh, everything really aligned the counter really aligned with order now so after we succeeded in that we can proceed with other that things so you can shift this up a bit so now everything is uh, uh we are we are getting there a little bit so now the next thing we are going to do here we are going to just put uh let's say the right up we say on point restaurant so let's say we say on point we have on point on point so that is their instagram and others so we are going to put that here so once we set one and we we'll make it fitting then the rest are so simple if it doesn't take uh, boldness you can go to stroke we we'll go to stroke and we increase the stroke a little bit we added the stroke a little bit and we increase the size to make it a uh, setting so after that we position it very well so as you can see so we now we are now going to be copy everything and position copy and position you can see so the last one we are going to copy and position very good so now everything as you can see is uh, actually plumb but I'm thinking of removing the stroke here. So let's remove the stroke back since it's too dark. 
so the last one we remove stroke and when you look at it everything is actually right mm -hmm. we have everything so now the next thing that we're going to do after gotten the whole thing is to add is to add some of effects is to add some effect so we'll go to the ramadan as you can see so we are going to the shadow we added the shadow reduce the opacity of that shadow after you turn it on to let's say 22 as i did your blur reduced to be 4 as you seen it then we go to the enable after glow offset y we are going to increase it to something like 3 and as you are doing it you must see the reflection so you make it to be much than expected then increase the broad radius and you increase this as well you can click on plus sign to reduce this so that it will not be too much then you can see that uh, the shadow really work on this now we are going to the promo as well because those are the two we are going to apply the shadow with so you are going to repeat the same process it's not necessary that you copy the same number you just look at it and until when you are able to satisfy with it now the work is done so like this one for instance the the shadow is too much so i'm going to increase and increase the sorry and increase i mean reduce the uh, uh the blur radius and the opacity then the offset y is okay so when you look at it let me reduce uh this a little bit too so i'm going to the shadow and reduce this reduce the blur radius as well and everything is actually plumb so i'm reducing this too so now everything work the way we want it and as you can see this is just a simple way of how you can make a ramadan promo flyer on your android smartphone using your pcr so now to now run everything up so under this we are going to copy bobby and we put free delivery as you can see free delivery so this doesn't have any uh, unnecessary or any editing we are, going to, we are just going to position it here and we have it being done exactly like this and everything is uh is cool as you can see so i believe we all learned something from here thanks for watching may god bless us let's save this and we check for sorry let's save it and we check for all that uh the second uh chicken last i talked about that we can switch it in so now that we have this being saved so i'm going to that chicken and i'm going to half it i'm going to turn on the second one then we look at it is there any much amendment there is so for instance we are going to amend this we can just save it like that then you can see we are going to even amend the bending the bending is not really aligned so let's check the bending like that uh, so it's cool like this it's actually cool so which among the two is the best i want you to try it out and uh, tell me which one is okay the first with the first uh chicken picture or the second one thanks for watching may god bless us